Orne El Camino, it's Pastor Bruce. Uh, right behind me you can see a queen palm and you may be able to notice that it's not doing very well. The palm fronds are brown. Uh, the new ones coming out are, are burned. They don't look good. Uh, the pods are, are uh, not looking good. Um, we've been trying to, we've fed it and we've watered it. We've talked to people about it and you know, and the reality is it is probably on the end. Um, they do have a lifespan. 25 years plus and that's about all you're gonna get and uh, then they they die so we're gonna have to probably cut it down and and uh, move on uh, made me think of this past week it was Palm Sunday and it's the Sunday that they that we remember Christ entering Jerusalem and uh, people grabbing palm branches and waving them and and crying out Hosanna uh, blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord and and the, the cry meaning save us now they all had plans for Jesus uh, coming into Jerusalem to set up his earthly kingdom and do all those things but that was not the plan that Jesus had in mind that was not God's plan um, Matthew chapter 16 Matthew chapter 17 uh, Mark chapter 8 records also uh, that Jesus had had several uh, conversations with his disciples about how he was headed to Jerusalem and that this was going to be the time when they betrayed him, arrested him, um, crucified him, and ultimately he would rise again. But in the middle of all that, that, that was not good. The disciples didn't understand it, didn't want it, didn't want to understand it, um, but nevertheless, it was what God was going to do. It was God's plan, God's time. And uh, in fact, all of creation to this moment where Jesus would give his life on the cross for us to pay for our sin, to redeem us, to bring us back to God. So this Friday, Good Friday, is a remembering of that, that time, the crucifixion. Here's the good news. Resurrection's coming. Sunday's coming. See you soon. Bye.